So let's find out what millionaires really are. John is one. John's in Houston, Texas. Hey, John, welcome to the Dave Ramsey Show. Hey, Dave, how are you? Better than I deserve, sir. What's your net worth? Oh, as of today, one million six hundred seventy-five thousand. Very cool. And uh, what's it invested in? Um, all of that. Well, let's see. We have one million three hundred fifteen in mutual funds, mm-hmm. and our house is worth three hundred fifty thousand. Okay. Very cool. And what do you guys? What have you made a year average through your working lifetime? Average year yeah. through your working lifetime. Average, I would say about one thirty. Okay. And uh, how old are you? I'm 59. My wife is 54. Okay. How much of this did you inherit? Zero. Okay. Um, and what you what have you done for a living? What's your primary career path that's caused uh, you to aircraft, make this? I'm sorry. Aircraft mechanic. Aircraft, aircraft mechanic. mechanic. And okay. My wife is a school teacher. Okay. So did you you've got a a technical degree or did you get a four year degree? Um, I did four years in the Air Force and got out and got my AMT power plant license and also private pilot on the side. Okay. All right. And, and so uh, what was your GPA in school? Uh, never went to college. Uh, but uh, Oh, four years in the Air Force didn't mean four years of college. Okay. So yeah. you, did you, But you took your technical work, and did they give you a grade on the technical work you were doing for the to become an aircraft pilot? Oh, yeah. Pilot? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I... It was in the A's. Uh, didn't really have a GPA. That's a pass-fail situation. Yeah, right. I got you. Okay. Yeah, they were, they were all in the, you know, 96, 95. Gotcha. So but how do you end up with a million, uh, 300,000 in your mutual funds at 59 years old? What did you do to cause that well, to happen? I, let me just tell you, you know, we, um, we came from a family of eight kids. Uh, Dad owned a grocery store, very small grocery store, so all the kids worked in there. And it's one of these situations where, you know, you, when you have a grocery store, labels come off the cans, so he brings these, these cans home. You didn't know if you were going to get dog food or, or a can of peas. <laughs> so uh, basically, you know, and the fruit and stuff like that. So fruit, fruit, and bring home peaches or apples or whatever. So that's apple pie, that's, you know, peach cobbler or whatever. Sure. And, um, you know, of course, all the kids worked in the grocery, grocery store, and I can remember in high school making 75 cents an hour. Um, then went into the Air Force and got out, and uh, I decided, you know, there's got to be a better way. So I started investing. This is in the 80s. I just started investing in anything and everything. And, you know, people back then, they had music CDs. And when a person say, yeah, I bought a CD, I would always ask them, well, what, what bank did you buy it at? And they were talking about a, a Michael Jackson CD or something like that. So I was just a nerd about investing and in, um what was the biggest what's well, the what do you put most money in you said mutual funds well that's where i made most of my money but the mistakes along the way i played with commodities and futures ended up losing forty thousand dollars on that i lost seventy five thousand in individual tech stocks and it wasn't but i still started doing mutual funds because in the back of my mind i wanted to get in something stable and then in 2000 is when I found you, and that's when I really started accumulating money. We got the house paid off. We paid, paid off $176,000 in seven years. Um, two daughters went through college. Um, I started to get my uh, funds for them uh, back in 85 and 87 for them. What's the most and expensive then, uh, pair of blue jeans you've ever bought? Oh, gosh. Last time I bought blue jeans was probably 10 years ago, and then probably... Twenty dollars, maybe. You're not still most. wearing those, are you? Uh, yeah, they're still in my closet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, good for you. <laughs> Me too. I just wanted to tell Sharon that that really happens, other than at our house. Yeah, okay. Exactly. <laughs> if, if, how many new car? How many new cars them. have you bought before you were a millionaire? We we have only bought one brand new car, and that's when my first first daughter was, you know, born. And we just felt like we needed something stable since then. Yeah. Everything's been used right now. John, you're, you're a great American hero. Congratulations. $1,675,000. Did you hear how he did it? Is that old Dave Ramsey investment advice that everybody on the Internet says is so awful? <laughs> yeah, I'm bragging. I'm happy for John. This is the Dave Ramsey Show. You guys would be so rich so fast and be able to do so much not only for yourselves and for your family, but for others.